does smell delicious. You've got some jumbo stuffed gourmet cookies in the oven right now that Griffin is actually going to pull out some of the ones that are ready. Oh my gosh, those are beautiful. Griffin, what flavor is that? That is going to be our pumpkin pie with caramel bits and chocolate chips. Oh my gosh, and that smells exactly how he described it. So Griffin and Abigail over here, they're actually getting married in like <laughs> seven days probably. Yeah. Abigail, you don't only do cookies, you do cookie cakes. That's what you're over here doing right now. Um, what's this process? It looks like you have all of those colors of icing in one bag. Absolutely, yeah, of course. So what I like to do, of course, so we do these crazy oh, cookie wow. cakes, but we love doing any kind of crazy colors. We just want to kind of set ourselves aside from every other person in town doing cookie cakes. We want to make sure they're unique. We want to make sure that the person who gets them loves them and feels like they're a work of art for them. That kind of is part of your name. A lot of people are like, who is Bay?" Or is that like the Bay that we throw around as like a slang? Yeah. What is your, what does the name mean and where did it come from? So a little silly, but it comes from our nickname. Uh, my nickname on Instagram is Bourbon Bay. And so my husband and I were joking around one day. We were like, well, why don't we just make it Bay's Bakery? Because yeah. we were, no I was known as Bay with all of our friend group and everything. Yeah, and, and Bay means, I'm pretty sure, like before, before anything, anything else. else. Yeah. And so we always say that our customers before anything else. Which is really, really cool. So you're making a cookie cake right now. There's also one in the box. Are these different flavors? These are going to be the same exact flavors. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to do one that's going to be a little bit inappropriate, one that's just going <laughs> to say thank you. So we'll make sure that we keep the appropriate one on here today. What is the deal with the inappropriate cookie cake? People just know that they can come to us for anything. So <laughs> basically people just know like, hey, if we need something really dirty written on a cookie cake, Bay's Bakery will do it for that us. so funny. It seems to be a trend. Can you imagine getting something that might not be completely appropriate and you just kind of bring the smile to your face? Griffin, I'm going to have you come over here. Explain to me what's happening. These have just expanded in like the last minute. Yes, it, it's such a crazy process watching them go in the oven and coming out. This is going to be the apple pie cookie. It is stuffed with an apple pie filling inside before it ever goes in the oven with a nice egg wash glaze on top that gives that nice brown to it. What are, what are we doing here? Where are these going? So I'm about to put these pieces of chocolate right on top of the pumpkin pie cookie, and then we're going to garnish that with a little uh, cute candy corn pumpkin on top as well, too. So <laughs> this is insane. Yes, it is so fun. Every day that we come in, we always have a fun time, especially with the different fun seasonal flavors. Yeah. It's just a breath of fresh air. So we told you guys earlier that these two both kind of quit their jobs and original career paths um he was an electrician she was like going to law school and whatnot so now they're doing this full time so it's just good to see good people doing good things in the community so come out and support bay's bakery and oh my gosh these cookies you guys oh my goodness oh, i they just look better, and better i want to try them all the pumpkin <laughs> spice the apple they're beautiful i've had the s'mores before but oh, yeah. i need to add to the collection <laughs> Oh man, so good. Oh gosh, Suzanne, do you have a pick? Or I, I, listen, I any one of them looks great, right? Oh my gosh.